Hi, children, how are you all? Hope you all are doing good. Today, we are going to learn ordering numbers. Before going that, let's count. One, two, three, four, five. We know how to count numbers. We know what number comes after number one. That is number two. Then what number comes after number two? That is number three. Then what number comes after number three? That is number four. Then what number comes after number four? That is number five. Then all of you take your Oxford Advantage Little Champ book theme four. In that book, all of you take page number 24. We know how to count numbers from 1 to 5. Today, what we are going to do? Ah, fill in the missing numbers and color the pumpkins. Okay, all of you look over there on the top. One has been done there. All of you look, one, two, three, four, five. Then down, down the second one. Then there are some numbers are missing. We have to find the missing number and write down and what? We need to color the pump, pumpkins also. Then first Number 1 is there, number 2 is there, then the next number is missing. Do you know what number comes after number 2? Yes, that's number 3. Then all of you write down number 3. Okay, then 1, 2, 3. Then what number comes after number 3? Yes, that's number Four. Then what number comes after number four? Yes, number five. That is given there. Then what you have to do? You have to color that pumpkins with yellow color. Then you have to do with. You have to color that pumpkins with yellow color. I'm going to next one. Then, oh, look, all of you look this row. Then, in that, the number one is there. We know what number comes after number one. That's number two. Yes, well done. Then, the number three is there. And then, what number comes after number three? Yes, that's number Four. Yes, well done. Then the number five that is given there. Then we are going to next row. Look here. The first, the first number is missing. Yes, we know what's the first number. That's number one. All of you write number one. Then the number two is there. Number three is there. Then the next number is missing. Then we know what number comes after number three. Yes, that's number four. Yes, then the next number is missing. Then what number comes after number four? Yes, well done. That's number five. Then you all need to color this pumpkin with yellow crayon. Okay, don't forget to do that. Then I'm going to last row. Then look, the number one pumpkin is there. Then the next number. Yes, we know what number comes number one. Yes, two comes after number one. Then the next number is missing there. Then what number comes after number two? Yes, well done. That's number three. Then the next number is also missing there. Okay, we know what number comes after number three. 
Yes, that's number 4. Then number 5 is given there. Then next, what you have to do? You need to color the entire pumpkins with what color? Yellow color. Okay, then we are going to next page. All of you take page number 25. Then over there, we can see some corn ice creams. What we have to do? Let's see what we have to do. Yes, draw the ice cream scoops and write the missing number on them. Ah, all of you look the first row, the first row, the first, the first cone is there, but the number is missing. What we need to do first, we need to draw a scoop. I am going to draw a scoop. Then after what we need to do, we need to write the missing number on them, on it. Then what number is missing? The number 1 is missing. Yes, well done. The number 2 is there. Then the next number is missing. Then we know what number comes after number 2. Yes, number 3. Then first we need to draw a scoop. Then inside that scoop what we have to do? We have to write the missing number. The missing number is Number 3, then the number 4 is there. The last, the last number is missing. Then first we, what we need to do? We need to draw a scoop. Then we know what number comes after number 4. That is number 5. Then we need to write number 5 on that scoop. Then I am going to next row. All of you look here. The first, the first in that, the number one is there on that scoop. The number one is written. Then the, after that, then the scoop is missing. Then first, we need to draw a scoop. Then we know what number comes after number one. Yes, that's number two. Well done. Then the number three is there. Then the number... 4 but that's missing then first we need to draw a scoop then we need to write number 4 then going to the next cone then there is also the scoop is missing then we need to draw a scoop then what number comes after number 4 yes it's number 5 yes then the last row, all of you look here, the number one scoop is there. The number two, that's also there. I'm going to next. There is only cone. Then we need to draw a scoop. What number comes after number two? Yes, it's number three. You need to write number three on that scoop. Then there is also the scoop is missing. Then you need to draw the scoop. Then what number comes after number 3? That's number 4. Well done. The next number is also missing. Then need to draw a scoop. Then what number comes after number 4? Yes, well done. That's number 5. Then thank you all of you. Take care.